Good day ladies, today I'm going to show you how to do a puff on ombre using nail couture colors as well as Glitter Addicts product nail art liner with white using a plate and a puffer. The first thing you need to remember is that a puffer should be clean before you do an ombre. So I just removed the debris and the fluff from the puffer using something sticky. Okay, so one thing you should remember that there should not be an inhibition or a tacky residue on your nails when you do use a puffer for an ombre. So make sure that you wipe the inhibition layer. In nail couture's case, we do have a dry finish, so I did not need to wipe. Okay, so I'm going to put in the product into the puffer. I used nail couture color on my nails. One, one, two. One, one, three, two. It's a beautiful French color. And then I am going to go on and puff the nail art liner into the puffer. And I want you to concentrate on not having too much product in the puffer. So once it's in there, just go about puffing out as much as possible. Please concentrate on what's happening on this nail plate. There should be almost no product on the puffer, as little product as possible. I'm going to just make a little dot here so that you can see it. Almost nothing in the puffer. That's really important. And then you're going to just go about bumping it from the free edge. And there you've got a perfect ombre. You will be curing that. So after a proper cure of 60 seconds, you will be doing a second layer. Once again, you're going to put in the white liner into the puffer and we are going to puff it out. Half of what we did in the first round and we are going to concentrate a little bit more on the tip of the nail. And this is there at the very front. side and now as well. This is how to do an ombre fringe in a short amount of time. Have a lovely day.